608, September is Workforce Development Month, and Goodwill of Southern Nevada is helping people that are preparing to enter the workforce. That's right. 8 News Now reporter Brian Will joining us live at the Goodwill's Career Center with the story and how they really do all of this um, technical help and assistance and work and training. And Brian, good morning. Good morning, Heather and John. Yeah, Goodwill has helped with this career center nearly more than 6,000 people just in the last year, and they're doing even more so this year. Joining me this morning is Brian Fukuzawa, who helps run this place. And Brian, tell us about what this center does. Yeah, so this is really designed to help people remove whatever barriers they may have to employment. So if somebody needs help with resume development, uh, interview skill building, just applying for jobs, or maybe they just need to meet with a career coach to even understand what barriers they may have, our goal is to remove those barriers, to open up opportunities for people to get into really whatever job they want to get into. Now, David's kind of going to show you, but we have a bank of computers here, and you can kind of press start to get started. Is that where a lot of this happens, is they kind of log on here and, and can do some of that stuff there? Yeah, absolutely. So uh, these computers are available free of charge. We have printers, copiers, scanners, all that great stuff that people can use where maybe they don't have the equipment at home. But our goal is really to, to dig a little bit deeper to help those individuals get into something that maybe they didn't think was possible uh, by providing different training opportunities and different uh, certification and skill building as well. Now, is there a story that sticks out in your mind of someone recently where, you know, has used this center and kind of what, what become, what, what were they able to do next? Absolutely. We, so we see it on a daily basis, which makes it really easy for me to come to work and do my job. But we have people who come here that have all sorts of barriers. Maybe they don't have childcare. Uh, maybe they don't have a resume. Maybe they don't have, think that they can even go after the jobs that they want to go after. We tell people to remove those, those blinds and just let us know what you want because we can probably help you get there. Well, thank you, Brian. And coming up in our next half hour, we're going to talk about their training programs here and also talk to someone who went through it as well. So stick around and you'll hear those stories coming up. Back to you guys.